When you're in AVIC, a complete network map is always visible at the top of your screen, but you can use the map search and filter tools to quickly zero in on specific areas. The search and filter tools are found in the top left corner of your map. Let's do a sample search to see how it works. First, close any open dialog boxes. Now you have a full, unimpeded view of the map. Click inside the search field to see a list of modifiers you can use to quickly narrow your search, or type a question mark to see a full list of modifiers. Let's say we want to find all the Dell gear on a network. We start typing in Dell. As we do, Avic recommends a match. Since we want to see everything from Dell, we highlight Dell under the vendor heading. Avic tells us how many results were found. And now on our map, the Dell gear is shown in color, while everything else that's not Dell fades to gray. We can zoom in for more detail and pan left and right to navigate. Hovering over a device shows us some quick information. Clicking through on the device shows you the device dashboard. Here's a complete inventory and performance stats for this Dell storage device. These tabs take you through to even more detail. You can see how a search can help you find things on your network in context with everything else. You can also search for multiple items at once to either refine or layer information. For example, let's say we want to see VLAN configurations on the network. Remember, to save you time, Avic provides suggestions as you begin to type. We start by highlighting VLAN 10. It shows up on our map in blue. Then we can layer on another VLAN to start doing comparisons. Now we can visually see the configuration of the network and how that might compare to how we think it's configured. We've had VLAN searches like this turn up a number of surprises for new clients. It's a really handy way to use the Avic map. You can also use the NOT parameter to remove items from a search. Let's say we want to find all the switches on our network except the Cisco switches. We use the NOT parameter for that. We can see that there are no results, which tells us that all of our switches are Cisco switches. Now let's go back to our initial search for any devices from Dell. Let's see what happens when we use the same query as a filter. You can type the same words directly into the filter field, which is here behind the funnel icon. But you can also turn any search you've already completed into a filter by clicking Apply Search as Filter. With a filter, our map is redrawn. Only the devices that meet the filter criteria are shown. Everything else is taken away. You can see we have the three Dell devices we found earlier. Clearing any filters or searches returns you to a complete view of the map. Avic also has some quick filters that are pre-configured to give you fast access to common views. Network Elements Only shows you only your network elements, such as switches, routers, firewalls, and so on. Layer 1 Only shows you just Layer 1. All the Layer 3 connections are removed. You can also create and save your own custom quick filters just by clicking this plus sign button next to quick filters on any view you want to save. And that's a quick tour of Map Search and Filter in AVIC.